Hey, this is Greg Gomez III with 100KMLM.com and MLMBusinessBlueprint.com, my blog. And uh, today I have something very important I want to discuss with you because this is really one of the most neglected things that network marketers are, are really just not ever taught about, about business, about being successful in marketing and sales in general. Now, today we're going to be talking about your most valuable asset as a network marketer and as a business owner. Now, the most common responses I get from folks when I ask them, and I'll ask you frankly, what do you consider the most important thing about your business? What's the most valuable asset that you have within your business? And I'm not talking about your desks or your cars or any of that fancy stuff. I'm talking about your business. What does it have to offer that nobody else has to offer? Or is really the most important thing about your business for your success? And these are the most common answers. Opportunity. My opportunity is fantastic. Oh, it's so great. It's a billion dollars. It's going to make so much money. Woohoo! No, that's not right. It's not correct. It's not the most important aspect. Is it your products and services? Is it the products? Is it because they're so unique? Quite frankly, no, it's not. Products and services are important. You want to make sure you have a product or a service that you provide that is valuable and does good, great results for folks, but that's not the most important asset that you have within your business. Aha! So it must be the business builders and the customers, of course, would be that, right? Because it's at the bottom of the list. Wrong. It's not that either. These are very important. And out of the three, these, obviously, your clients, your customers, your business builders, those are the most important uh, they're not assets, they're people, uh, but they are the most important things within your organization to help you obviously get paid your residual checks and earn that income and obviously uh, to expand your empire beyond the far reaches of your corners of your state. But as important as all of these three things are, most importantly these last one, there's one thing that trumps them all. And this is what networkers just don't seem to be taught properly, so I'm going to tell you about it today. There's one thing that I go to whenever I need a cash injection, or there's one thing that I go to uh, whenever I need to put more people into my business, or if there's more uh, things that I want to generate revenue-wise, or just make my business more successful. And it is my list. It's a four-letter word. It's my list. There's nothing else to it. It's a button list. You push that button, you make money. Your customers, your business builders, all of those guys, all of those people who join you in your business opportunity and your products and services need to come from your a list, a well-maintained list. This is, a, this is the problem that most network marketers have. This is the way we're taught to market for the most part. We're taught to actually go out, talk to a person one time, right? And if they say the dreadful no, we move on to another person, right? Another person. And we keep continuing to do that until we wind up getting to a person that says, okay, and then we got to start the process all over again, right? I'm going to introduce a new way of marketing to you. Uh, hopefully, that uh, hopefully you've heard this and you understand this, and you're making tons of money with it. But if you're not, this should be very uh, revealing for you. Let's say that your prospect starts off at this wall. Here is a happy prospect, woohoo! And here is a an indifferent prospect. I had to think about how to spell it. All right, so this is an indifferent prospect, and this is a happy one. Somebody that wants to do business with you. Okay, it's probably too small. You might not be able to see, but I'll zoom in here with the, the after effects. Well, what happens is, if you have this person on a list, well, typically, let me just go over what happens here. You go to this indifferent prospect, you position, proposition them. They say no, they go away, and that's the end of your sales process. That's the end of your marketing process. Well, that's not a marketing process. That's a, that's a conversion process. There is a difference. When you have a list of prospects, though, you get to change this around. What you can do is you actually start to drip little marketing messages on these folks that explain the benefits what, of what your product, service, opportunity have to offer them over the long haul. I'm not talking about... Uh, hypey types of, oh, you make so much money, oh, you should have made so much money, oh, last week you could have made so much money. That doesn't work in today's market, not near as well as, it, as, as some of the other approaches you're talking about. What you really want to do is have messages that have extreme value, not based on your perception, but on your prospect's perception. Uh, case in point, I think I give some pretty phenomenal content for free for folks, and I get comments all the time from people who say, I can't believe you're giving this stuff away for free. I buy other programs that have this stuff that I have to pay hundreds of dollars for, thousands of dollars for, and you just give it away for free. Yeah, that's the way I like to do things. Because my attitude is, if I give you this much free content, what do you get on the inside and see my, my paid content? Okay. But the more value that you provide, the more trust you're going to get from your prospects. And eventually, they're going to go up this little ladder with all these different contacts. And eventually they're going to get to here and they're going to say, you know what? That great character is pretty all right. He's pretty good all right. I'm going to make a decision 
to buy. Now, this is so important. When you have a list, when you have a big group of people that you can go to and constantly add more value and, and, and provide more good content, you will actually get recognized as an authority in your, in your marketplace. You get lots of people that will come to you and say, hey, I, I need your advice. I, 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 you, you're going to be surprised at how many people are going to come to you and ask your opinion before they make any kind of decision. And the neat thing is, is when you do it this way, when you actually do get this happy client, these people are going to be pr uh, clients for life. Or they can be clients for life. It's my phone. You have to ignore it. One of the things that happens here is that even if your network marketing company goes down the tubes, even if they, they fold, these people are still going to be uh, connected to you. They're going to be following you. So if you jump to another company, it's easy to get those folks to follow you along. This is how you'll see some of these top distributors coming out of nowhere and boom, shoot right to the top. It's because they understand this concept and they understand how to implement it to be able to bring people from one organization to another. Okay. So the next obvious question, I know you're going to ask it. I know you're going to ask it, so let me go ahead and answer it for you right now. How do I build a list? Well, the answer is really simple. There are several different ways you can do it. You can do it through social media. You can do it through pay-per-click marketing. You can do it through all kinds of different methods. But there are several different pieces that you have to have in place to be able to make that happen. Now, I can sit here and give you a small brief course on how to be able to do list building. But quite frankly, I could do what I could do in a few minutes on a free training won't compare to a $2,000 program that I'm going to actually be able to give to you for free. This is pretty awesome. I'm really excited to do this. Uh, a good friend of mine, or actually a, a good mentor of mine, Telman Knudsen, is offering his training program on doing list building. Now, let me tell you a bit about Talman. Talman is a multi-million dollar earner, internet marketer, and has been doing it for a number of years. He, has, he is a guru to a lot of the gurus about list building. So when you see a lot of companies going out there promising and teaching you, especially in the network marketing arena, about how to be able to be successful online with your businesses, he's actually the type of person that teaches them through his marketing material and his systems exactly what is working in the industry for those folks to go out there and be successful doing it. So he teaches them, and then they wind up filtering it to you. And it used to be up until now that you had to spend at least $2,000 to get a copy of his course uh, for his list building strategies. Well, he's actually running a promotion right now that you can actually get that course for free. I've already gotten it. I've signed up for it again just to get it again. But the key is, is that you need to get over to the link that's below here on the blog. Or if you're at YouTube, you'll see the link up here in the top right-hand left. Yeah, your right-hand corner. I always forget where I am. Uh, click on that link. It'll direct you to the page, and all you have to do is pay for the shipping, uh, shipping and handling charges, which is like five or six bucks. I didn't see what it was. I think it's like seven bucks or so. But you take care of that shipping and handling charge, and they'll ship the DVD to you right away, and you'll have his entire course that you'll be able to study and learn how to be able to do this. I'd love for your comments and your feedback. Post them below, but click on the link. Don't hesitate because he only has 5,000 copies, and as of the email he just sent me a little while ago, they only have about 1,000 copies left. I got one of them, so there's only 999 left, so you better run over there and get them now. I look forward to seeing you in the next video. I'll talk to you then.